How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to the Boogeyman. So uh, let's let's shoot this bird. Let's, let's shoot this bird with a pistol. Cover your ears, Lance. Okay. God, you should have told me you can fire that thing. It's like you're trying to freak me out. Cover your ear. Well, what do you think he's gonna do? He has a pistol. You... <laughs> What do you think he's gonna scream at the bird? Ah! No, 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 yeah, yeah. He was gonna scream at the bird. Do Come I have to on. Give you notice for everything to keep you from wetting yourself? That seems to be gone. Yeah, just a little bit. Forget it. Are you sure this was the best place for that? There was only one bullet. Could have kept it for later. Maybe. If you couldn't trust someone else to carry a loaded gun around, just be glad it didn't discharge or blow off a hinge. Oof. Yeah, that would suck. I'm not even bothering reading the description, because I don't care. I don't care how it's described. I just want to go home. No. Alright. That was the wrong way. I wanted to go this way. Okay, screw you, Lance. I'm going to leave you behind. You're too slow for my liking. Also, what the hell is this thing? Give me your tender kiss. Oh, I don't know if I want to do that. Alright, see you, Lance. <laughs> and somehow he catches up to me. How this happens, I... I don't know. I'm going to assume not really, but you know, whatever. Okay. See you, Lance. Ah. Oh boy. Hey, ah. detective. Ah. Lance, you're pretty late. Had trouble leading the wounded man along, is it? Uh, excuse me? Listen, Lance, don't get in the detective's way. This game is between me and him, you know. If you I have to fear <laughs> too much, I'll punish you again. Get away from there. Oh, how keen, detective. Just as you surmise, there's someone you need to protect here. Oh, yes, Detective. There's something I've been meaning to ask. Oh, boy. Say there were two helpless people in peril. Say you had to save one. I already and don't. Just nope. leave the other no. Nope. No, nope. F you. I don't like this statement would you already. Save in that case? I'd find a way to save both of them. What if you had to choose between a girl with a bright future or an adult doing good work for society? Okay, that's definitely Sophie and, uh, is that David? No, okay. Sophie and Richard. You bastard. He is just a little. Justice is heartless, you see. It's unfair. It's all choosy. You're an ass. But I'm impartial. I can send these two to hell together. How about you go there first? So, detective, which will you save? Both. I'm just not gonna tell you how I'm gonna do it. And don't tell me both. As Fuck soon you, as I already one, did. The other will fall. And you know what'll happen down that hole. Who don't says you? Who says I'm gonna raise either of them? I'm pretty sure there are different ways to figure out how to Truth save is, them. Though, I know who you really want to save. Oh, how I pity you, detective. Are we talking about Helena? Bye-bye now. Uh, excuse me? Uh, what? Uh, oh, okay. Hey, you guys okay? Okay. All right. Keith, please, save Sophie. I'm begging you. No, Papa, don't. Mr. Keith, don't. 
Don't do that! Don't do that to me. Oh, okay. Sophie, it'll be okay. Stay calm. Uh. Don't cry, don't cry. It'll be okay. I don't know if I wanna do I wanna take Lance with me? Uh um, help us, Sophie. It's okay now. Everything will be just fine. Just fine. I'm gonna go on mute for a sec on this because my computer is dumb and for some reason the game won't run while I s scroll the guide to where it needs to be. Yeah, I don't get I don't get this. All right, Lance. Um, we're gonna go back the way we came for who knows why, and I can't save. Oh boy. Um. What? Lift Richard and drop Sophie? You really sure? If the spikes break the table. She won't be hurt. Wait. Uh. Okay. I mean, you're right, but. That's clever. Sophie, hey. Lance, pull the lever when I say pull. Sophie. Sophie, I'm going to lift Richard and drop you. No, Keith, drop me, please. Don't put my dear daughter in danger. Don't worry. Quiet. Sophie, don't look down, okay? We'll be fine if you don't look down. You with me? No funny stuff. Don't cry, Sophie. I won't let you die. I won't even let you get hurt. I promise. Aw. So believe me. And just don't move. Okay. That's a good girl. <laughs> she she like a dog now. Good girl. Good girl, Sophie. What the... Lance, are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Pull. Mr. Keith, are you okay, Mr. Keith? Ouch. How about you? I I'm fine. I don't have a scratch on me. But you, Mr. Keith? Oh, boy. Glad to hear it. Sorry, little lady, but could you move it? Feels like I'm gonna be crushed to death. <laughs> yeah, if she sat on you any longer, you probably would be. Papa! Sophie! Aww. Oh, Sophie. I'm so glad you're safe. Papa. Papa, it was so scary. Hey, hey you okay? I had no idea you were gonna. Lance, how's my head look? <laughs> it's crooked. Huh? Those spikes really grazed it. Wondered if they sheared my hair. Did I go bald? No! <laughs> Don't worry. It's still plenty fluffy. Okay. If that's how we're describing Keith, it. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much for saving my daughter. Let's take this elsewhere. Come with me. Okay. We're gonna Lance, have... How are those wounds? Are you still hurting? Damn right I am. But I guess it's a little better now. Wounds heal over time. No weird traps in this room. No windows either. Just that one door in or out. Shouldn't have to worry about that guy ambushing you. Oh yeah, because he's not going to walk in that one door at all. No. I'll go look for the others. So you stay here. Don't leave this room under any circumstances. How about lock the doors? Hey, will you be all right? Better than I'd be dragging around a wounded man and a family. That 
was just rude. Hey! What? Didn't I just tell you to stay in there? Uh, what you said before. Whatever it was. About civil liberties groups. Great, we're talking about Did this. Did I say anything like that? Don't uh, play dumb. You. What do you know? Are you trying to threaten me? Huh? Now I'm confused. What? I felt bad for the girl, no doubt. But you went about it all wrong. Sorry, but I just can't approve of that. What? Okay, that makes sense. It's your policy not to photograph people. It's not quite accurate, is it? It's not that you won't. You can't. Since you don't listen to what you're told. You don't love scenery. You just hate people. Okay, that makes sense. How do you know that? I didn't say anything about that. You researched? You got your eye on me? He's a detective. What the hell do you think? How do you think he knows? Are you just some cop? You're not state. How the hell? He's a detective. How dumb are you? And that other guy talked like he knew too. What the hell is this? What do you guys know? It's not that hard to tell. Done talking. Use that if he comes for you. His big head should be an easy target. <laughs> Don't worry. It'll be justified self-defense. No tabloid stardom for you. If anyone, it'd be me. Yeah. Um. I suggest you come up with a quip for the press. The detective ordered me to say. Or are you more accustomed to being the press? Well, LK. Back in the room. You should follow their example instead of picking a fight with me. Yeah. I wouldn't want to pick a fight with you. Wait, what? It says I'm still in the cutscene, but... Um... Hello? Well, this is a problem. back okay it was a bug for some reason I don't know what happened but we got an achievement as well rescue mission 2 cool now I don't know where to go next oh yes yeah, sure why don't we jump over the hole there's nothing wrong with this Huh? I didn't jump over the hole. Hole I teleported to the other side. What? What? Um. Sure. Sure. Uh. What? Seems to be a real guillotine. The edge is rusty though. Painting of a woman holding a severed head. There's a placard underneath. Ah, oh, Jokanon. I kissed your lips. They had such a bitter taste. Was it the taste of blood? No. It must be the taste of love. As everyone says, love is bitter. What? Not literally. This is how I go down my stairs. <laughs> um
nothing to prevent myself from dying. Thank you very much. Yeah, I kind of figured. Ow! Okay, ow! That really hurt, you know. That hurt a lot. Okay. Here we go again. Alright. Um, do you want to go right or down? Okay, we go right. Um, there are two buttons on the wall. Hammer. Can I have the other one too? Left button has been pressed. Pressing them isn't going to do okay. Can I break this? Alright, well, let's break down the door. No, I didn't do anything. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Yeah, we'll figure it out next time. I'm going to leave this video here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Well, we saved Sophie and her dad in this video, so that's good. If you liked this video, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. Boogeyman is starting to piss me off. If... <laughs> If you really like the video, consider subscribing to the channel. Got any suggestions for any other um, horror games you'd like to see on in here? Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out any others that I've done prior to this game? Link to one will be across my head here. This game will be in the top right hand corner over there. In the meantime, I'm out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye!